Hi, you guys. Welcome to Audrey's Reading Area. Yes, I have another fun and exciting book that I'll be reading to you. But look down. You see that subscribe button? S-U-B-S-C-R-I-B-E. Smash it for me. Smash that subscribe button. All right, all right, all right. Yeah. Now, share this video with everybody so that they can see me read all these fun and exciting books to them too. Like this book here, Tony Baloney. That's the book I'll be reading to you guys today. Tony Baloney. Tony Baloney, by, written by Pam Munoz, or Munoz, Ryan, and Edwin, oh boy, Fotheringham. Fotheringham. Okay, I think I got it right. Today, Tony Baloney, I'll be reading. Tony Baloney does not love trouble. But trouble loves him. Wow. So let's see what fun and exciting adventures Mr. Tony Baloney is going to go on today. Tony Baloney. So it says, Tony Baloney is a macaroni. <laughs> Penguin. <laughs> he loves fish tacos with Parmesan cheese. Little green walrus guys, his stuffed animal buddy, dandelion, and anything with wheels. Hmm. Tony Baloney does not love trouble, but trouble, lo trouble loves him. In his family, Tony Baloney is smack in the middle of the brood. Dandelion makes sure that Tony Baloney does not get lost in the crowd. If he can help it, Tony Baloney stays away from the bothersome baby's baloney because they are so exasperating. When it is absolutely necessary, or most of the time, Tony Baloney must play with Big Sister, Sp Big Sister Baloney. He always has to be the kitty. When do I get to be the boss of the world? Tony asks. <laughs> Tony Baloney asks. Big Sister Baloney gives him the look. <laughs> Mew says Tony Baloney. <laughs> Old clocks. That's that look. <laughs> I used to give my little brothers. <laughs> Sometimes when Tony Baloney is tired of Big Sister Baloney and exasperated by the bothersome baby's baloney, Dandelion it Dandelion behaves badly. Mm -mm. After Dandelion runs amok, Tony Baloney dashes to his room, stuffs all of his important things into his duffel, and makes a fast getaway to his hidey space. Eventually, Mama and Papa stop by for a little chat. Mm -mm. After they leave, Tony Baloney tells Dandelion all of his woes. As usual, Dandelion is extremely understanding. And then Big Sister said I could not come to her tea party. And the bothersome babies chewed off the hands of maybe a hundred or just one of my little green walrus, walrus guys. And mama and papa said they love me very much. But I need to think about our behavior and using our words and saying we're sorry. Oh, and we have to mean it too.
I guess we should try a little harder to behave, says Tony Baloney. I suppose, says Dandelion. We have to apologize. Nicely. I am not feeling nicely in my heart. How long does it take for nicely to creep in? <laughs> Maybe never, or in a little while. Just wait for it. You're my very best buddy in the whole whitey world. I know, I know. Don't get all mushy on me. After Tony Baloney has been in the hidey space for maybe a year or 20 minutes, he feels a teensy bit lonely and Dandelion feels a teensy bit like apologizing. When Tony Baloney smells fish tacos, Dandelion feels even more like apologizing. Mm -mm. Dandelion says he's sorry. I accept Dandelion's apology, big sister Baloney huffs. But what do you have to say for yourself, Tony Baloney? She gives him the look. <laughs> Tony Baloney says nicely, I brought Parmesan cheese. For maybe an hour or five minutes, Big Sister Baloney allows Tony Baloney to be boss of the world. Tony Baloney tells the bothersome babies Baloney that they must must be the kitties. They gotta be the kitties for now. The babies are surprisingly good at meowing. Tony Baloney, you don't ever have to be the kitty again, says Big Sister Baloney. Never, says Tony Baloney. Never, says Big Sister Baloney. And she keeps her word. She makes them meow, I guess. Woof, woof. She's making him be the dog and not the cat. <laughs> She was up to something, huh? The end. Oh, the end. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you so much for being here and listening to me read these fun and exciting books like Tony Baloney. Yeah, I know I had fun reading to you guys. I hope you guys had fun listening. So please, please, please don't forget, smash that subscribe button if you haven't done it already. And tell everybody to come on over and smash that, that subscribe button too. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Audrey's Reading Area, I am here for you. And I will see you soon.